Hello everyone, this ECG machine is a NIDEC 12 channel ECG machine and it is one of the basic diagnostic tool for uh, cardiologists and uh, general physician. It can be used to perform all routine diagnostic checks and it is very simple to use and very precise as uh, this machine uh, has a sampling rate of 4000 Hz per channel and uh, the paper size is also a standard uh, paper size of uh, 210 mm by 30 mm and it has a 7 inch uh, screen which is uh, LCD and has a storage of uh, 250 uh, ECGs so this is the machine you can see the alphanumeric uh, keypad and the navigation buttons as well this is the power button and this is the uh, ECG printing button. This is the patient button to feed all the patient details. This is the menu button and this is the paper compartment. You have a handle on top of the machine. On the right side of the machine, you can see there is a power outlet and a thin connection. You have a Ethernet, LAN and USB and this is the ECG patient cable connector at the back uh, we have uh, all the details of the machine like the serial number etc etc along with the machine uh, you get a user manual uh, a warranty card and there is an accessories box uh, inside the box you get uh, the ECG cable you get the gel you get an earthing cable you also get a power cord this is the roller which is used uh, to put use the paper roll to get the paper roll as well this is the limb electrodes and the chest electrodes so all the accessories uh, you get along with the machine so we'll just turn on the machine right now so just hold the button and the machine will start so this is the screen so here in the corner you can see which mode the machine is running on this is the sensitivity this is the printing speed these three are the filters which has to be always on this is uh, the date uh, and time these are all the details like uh, the patient uh, name then the uh, id of the patient then whether it is male or female age of the patient this is the battery indicator so now we'll uh, feed the paper inside the machine this is the area where you can put your fingers and lift it up once you lift it up the door will open this is the roller you will get along with the machine so just uh, put it inside the paper roll and then you have to match this roll in this area on both the sides so once you feed it inside it will go inside it align the paper and match this three notch over here so once the paper is aligned just press the door so once the paper is loaded inside the machine we will start uh, feeding the patient uh, parameters as you can see this is uh, the patient button over here you can press the button and this is the kind of dialog box you will see at the screen so now we need to put the name of the patient so you can directly type it from here like uh, I'll type C L I F F O R T. So that's uh, the name of the patient. Then you have to press uh, down arrow. So to put the ID, whatever you want, like zero 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 one two three four. Then you can press down. You can use this navigation keys to go here and there so 
so now we have to put the gender now here you have a button for male and female so you just press male so it will come over here then again put the age here the height weight the blood pressures and the hospital name so once everything is uh, done press the patient uh, button again so all the data will be saved automatically so now here you can see at the display you can see the name the id which we have put male 32 years so all the data has been fed inside the machine so now this is uh, the mode which we which is the machine is currently running so we have four modes in this machine there is a mode button here which you can press this is the mode button so this is the auto mode in which uh, everything uh, the uh, waveform analysis interpretation everything will work on automatic uh, mode and this is the best mode you can use it then the second mode is the rr mode the histogram mode third is the store mode in this mode uh, there will be no ecg printing it will directly store it uh, anyways uh, whenever you take a print the ecg is automatically saved as it has uh, 250 uh, storage for ecg and then uh, this is the manual mode uh, this mode is used for a long lead print and uh, so this is the auto mode suppose uh, you want to take the print so you just have to press this button so once you press it the print will start as you can see you will get all the 12 leads here all the information below so this is the interpretations on the screen as well once you get this you have to press uh, the run button again once you press it you will get the print on the paper as well and then if you want to press uh, save this ecg you have to press f1 button this is the f1 button so once you press this button your ecg will be saved so this is how the print will look the waveform all the interpretations and analysis over here along with all the data here so this was the auto mode so now we can move to the next mode which is uh, rr mode now we are in rr mode so once you start the ecg you can see it here so this will take uh, around 60 seconds so as you can see the 60 second is uh, completed so now the machine will start printing so this is the interpretations which we have got so now we have to press the run button so now we get the print so here you can see 0 second 10 20 30 40 50 seconds this is the interpretations the histogram so this is how the print will look in rr mode So now we'll see the manual mode which is uh, the long lead mode so once you press the button you can see this is the long lead which you are getting so as long you press stop it will keep on printing so once you press stop it will. so this is the long lead along with all the details here So now let's look uh, the settings here is the menu button so once you press the menu button there are uh, four uh, menus first one is the clock then the basic menu then the advanced menu and then the tools so you 
to toggle between this menus you have to keep on pressing menu like once you again press menu we'll go into advanced tools clock so the clock here you can set whatever you want to set the date and time everything use the navigation key to go up and down and the numbers and the alphanumeric to put the data so this is the basic menu where you can set the sensitivity the printing speed manual mode uh, you want 12 channel 3 channel plus plus 6 channel there are many configurations so you can put it on 12 so this is the auto mode 12 channel rhythm lead whichever lead you want to put second third mostly we put it on second and by default you will get it on second only so this is the auto record time this is very important uh, like you if you want to save the paper you can uh, make it short as well then the print will be much more comprised and compact and short you can keep it normal or you can keep it long even longer so that how you can set in the auto record time and then um, there is one more part uh, report print format here if you need all the parameters you can keep it all parameters if you want nothing only the waveform put it on none or if you want only the parameter not the inter this thing uh, analysis you can set parameter only but we would prefer to keep it all parameter and then uh, if you press the menu these are all the advanced uh, settings like pen heater QRS beeper, keypad beeper, etc. etc. These are the tools and these are the ECG files, the saved files. <coughs> so once you go here, you have to press the navigation key right side. So here we'll get all the saved data. Like just now we did uh, by this name. So you will get it over here so you can navigate go down once you go down then you have to press the right side arrow to see the ecg so once you press the right side arrow this is the ecg which you got which has been saved if you want to see the review it shows you have to press the menu button so you can see the symbol here here is the symbol so press this We'll get the menu like if you want to save it you want to see the analysis you want to print it again and then you have to press this symbol f1 button to return to the previous menu so this one so if you want to get a print again from here you can go to the review button and then again press your right button and it says press F1 to start from display so you have to press the F1 button so you will get the print which has been saved earlier so you can see So this is a very simple to use machine, a 12 channel ECG machine from NIDEC model 712. Thank you.